Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a Magic Review. Quick, what number am I thinking? I should have given you some parameters, right? I forgot. Uh, I'm thinking of a number between five and 40. I'm thinking of a number between five and 40. Tell me your answer below. I will not tell you if you are right. I will just send the answer to you mentally. I'll just tell, you'll know, okay? If you're right, I've told you. I've told you you're right. I'm also joking. Welcome back to the channel, guys. Thanks for being here. I'm always trying to find some new thing to say at the beginning. So that was my uh, meager attempt at variety. Needless to say, I failed miserably. But you're here because you wanna see a magic review, and that's what I do best. Uh, filming, video editing, recording, variety, eh, not so much. But magic reviews, yes. So if you like magic or you like magic reviews, you wanna make sure that you like this video, subscribe to this channel, so that you can stay up to date on the latest and greatest tricks that are coming out. That's what I do. I wanna take the ad copy and kind of crumple it up, throw it in the garbage, and tell you exactly what your money gets you. Today, we're gonna to look at Color Fool from Victor Zotko. What is Color Fool? Color Fool, it's a play on words for colorful, right? This is a color change. Now, it's a color change of a top card. So the top card is blue, and you wave a card over it, and it turns red, okay? It's a transformation. It's a gimmicked transformation. So this is a gimmicked color change. Now, whereas uh, some magicians can do color changes, you know, without any gimmicks at all. You could do an urdnaise, you could do a paintbrush change, right? There's lots of kind of things you can do uh, that, that would create the same effect, obviously. But this is a gimmicked version. And what separates this from perhaps uh, one just on a sleight of hand is that you're using the top card as cover. And as you wave the top card over the deck, the card beneath changes. And the card is actually so high above the deck, there's no point of contact, okay? So whereas in Erdnays, your hand is like right on top and you're doing this kind of motion, with Color Fool, the card is this high above the deck and as you move it over the top, the color changes. So it's a slow motion color change of the top card with gimmicks. All right, so what's in the box? Let's say you pay your $30 to your favorite Murphy's Magic Retailer, what are you gonna get? Uh, you're gonna get a small envelope. Inside that, you're gonna get a handful of colored gimmicks. My gimmicks were blue, so this would be a blue to red gimmick, right? And then you'll get the download code to the video. The video is roughly 17 minutes long. Is it what I thought? I really didn't know what to think. I was open to anything. I figured it could be magnets, it could be invisible thread, it could be uh, you know some sort of a flap card, right? I was open to anything. And surprisingly, it was a little bit of everything. How are the angles? The angles are restrictive. You cannot have people on your sides and you definitely want people looking down on this object. So this is something you're holding below, maybe down at waist level or down on the table, but uh, people are hopefully standing and peering down at it. Now, if you're doing it on social media, uh, social media angles would be great because you have your camera above and everything is pointed down. And that's really the angle you need. Can it be inspected? Like I said, this is fully gimmicked. And after the trick, your deck will still be dirty. There's no ditch taught. Um, you'll have to ditch your gimmicks, but I think once you ditch your gimmicks, you'll have a full deck and you could go into any routine. What's the overall quality and production value of the video? It is well shot and filmed. It's mostly over the table shots with a voice over. As far as what they're gonna teach you, like I said, it's only 17 minutes long. You do get an intro. He talks about what you get. There's a setup, how to do the color change from blue to red, and then he'll even teach you how to go back in time and go from red to blue. Then he'll give you a routine so that you can do this as a color changing deck trick where the spectator selects a card, it's lost back in the deck, you take out your uh, magic wand card and change the deck from blue to red, and then you fan the cards, and the only blue card left is their chosen card. And then he'll go through the explanation of that trick, and then he'll give you some tips and tricks at the end. Is it all well made? I mean, everything's made out of bicycle cards, really. It's, it's, these are propped bicycle cards, you know, gimmicked 
gaffed, shimmed, as it were. Pocket space, I think if you remove your two jokers and your two ad cards, everything will fit inside the tuck case. All right, so how much practice does it require? Um, it's hard to say because I, I spent some time with this and it didn't work for me every single time. So I think the first couple of times I did it, uh, it worked great. But then there was a couple of times where it missed and it didn't work exactly as I wanted to. So I feel like you're really gonna have to spend some time with the gimmicks and get used to them. How much setup and reset is there? Uh, I mean, it's a full deck setup. You have to have this set up in the deck box, in the tuck box, ready to go, right? You have to walk up ready to perform. You can't like do your get ready. You, you know, you can't, this has to be the first trick you do. So right out of the box. But then, like I said, if you ditch everything, then you'll have a clean deck and you'll be able to do standard card tricks afterwards. All right, so positives. What are the positives? Uh, I think this is a gorgeous color change that looks like a camera trick and it'll blow your friends online away. Negatives, all right, so what are the negatives? You know, like I was saying at the beginning of this, um, this just makes uh, standard slight gimmicked, right? So this, this style of effect, especially when you just think of the Erdnays color change, like the, the most popular color change, right? Probably the most popular tot. Um, this just makes it slight less, but now gimmicked. So you're just moving from one to the next. So, you know, a purist who only likes to work with a deck of cards, you know, they would say, well, why do I need this? Because I can do this without the gimmick. And the person who prefers gimmicks would say, yes, but uh, this is so much more cleaner because my hand and the card are way above the deck. Like I'm not making any contact. The magic is happening, uh, you know, without me touching the deck. And I would agree. So that's what makes the trick look beautiful. And I would probably like this trick a lot more if I felt like the prop worked 100% of the time and I didn't find that to be. So I found it the, the attraction devices were not consistent for me. And there was a couple moments where uh, it would peak or flash, which means is it worth your money? It's $30. Um, I, would, I would strictly reserve this for online use because with online use, you're gonna make sure that you have your angle perfect, right? And if the gimmick does go a little wonky, you'll just reshoot it and you'll be fine. And I think online, the effect looks beautiful and you'll have a thousand comments from kids saying, how did you do that? But don't just take my word for it, don't. I am one voice in the ocean of magic reviews. Jump into the ocean, swim <laughs> in the ocean. Go see other channels, get other opinions. Most importantly, Craig Petty, Craig Petty's Magic TV, make sure you go watch his channel. I think he actually mentions this trick twice. I think he has twi tw twice videos. I think he has twi I think he has twice videos about this. Make sure you go check him out. Make sure you subscribe to his channel too. It's awesome. Wizard Magic Review. Wizard Magic Review also uh, had this in one of their longer review sections. You gotta fast forward to find it. And then Prop Dog. Uh, they looked at this in one of their live sessions. So look for the Prop Dog live session. All right, that's everything I can say about Color Fool from Victor Zotko. I'd like to thank Murphy's Magic Supplies for allowing me to have this so that I could do the review for you, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. But wait, are you not getting enough magic orthodoxy in your life? Not getting enough of your very favorite magic reviews? Good news, you can join this channel. That's right, you can join Magic Orthodoxy for only $1.99 a month, $1.99 gives you access to eight brand new videos every single month. Eight, eight new videos that are unseen by the rest of the world. You will have exclusive access to them. Plus, if you join right now for a buck 99, you'll get access to over a hundred videos that are already in the membership section. That's right, a hundred videos. What kind of content? Even more magic videos, top 10 lists, best of the year, head-to-head -head magic tricks, and my exclusive thoughts on performance and theory. Two extra videos every single week, $1.99. Just scroll down to where it says Magic Orthodoxy. There's a button next to it that says Join. Click the Join button, and it'll walk you through a series of menus that'll hook you up and get you access today.